Hi, I'm Noah, and today I'm going to show you how to use CD burners. CD burners have become extremely common over the past several years and are an extremely handy tool for either safeguarding information or sharing pictures or simply transferring files. Although most burning software solutions you'll have to pay for, you can also find some basic ones which are free like CD Burner XP, which can be found at http cdburnerxp.se. These programs just offer basic burning capabilities. The software suits that you pay for, however, will offer lots of additional capabilities, like for example being able to make menus for your DVDs that you might burn with video files. So once you have a burning program and you've inserted a blank CD into your DVD burner, you'll need to run the program and select the files that you want to burn. Pretty much all burning software works in a similar way. You simply first select what files you want to add to your disk, click Add, and then once you've selected all the files you want and you're ready to make your CD, you select Burn. Now finally, before you start the burning process, you'll be able to choose what speed you want it to be done at. Keep in mind that the lower the speed, the higher the chances of your copy being successfully made are.